Today I would like to show you how to fix the issues on your iPhone, iPod or your iPad and you can see on my iPhone SE in my hand right here it just keep rebooting and it's stuck at the Apple logo and here is the video how to fix it for the software it does support on iOS 14 as well now before we go into this video I would like to show you the giveaway from Wondershare Doctor Phone and to get the giveaway from Wondershare Doctor Phone, you can just go to their website and you can find the link from uh, my video description. Wondershare Doctor Phone just um, launched a new giveaway for all of you guys who want to win iPhone 12. And you can just click on join now and after that it will bring you to this page where you can answer the question. And then you can select one of the answers that suit you the best. And after that, you can just um, include your email and you can finally click on submit to win the new iPhone 12. And one more thing, if you want to get 40% off from Vanessa Doctor phone, you can just um, go to here and click on get 40% off coupon. And you can share this into Facebook or share into Twitter. Now let's go into how to fix the issues on your iPhone, iPod or your iPad um, when you stuck at boot loop. So you can go to Vanessa Doctor phone right here. And after that, um, you have two different choice, but um, we have retained data. And for those of you that want to fix the issues or downgrade without um, losing any data, you can use standard mode. However, if standard mode doesn't work, you can click on advanced mode where um, it does erase all of the data on your phone, which means photo application will be erased and then it should be able to downgrade and, and also fix the issues on your phone. Now for this demonstration, I'm going to click on Advanced Mode. Now, in order to fix the issues on my iPhone, I need to put my device into DFU mode first. Now on my iPhone SE, I can just hold on the Home button and plus the Power button for 10 seconds. And after the screen goes black, I can just um, release the Power button. But keep holding the Home button after um, the iTunes pop up. Now let's do it. Now release the power button, but keep holding the hold. Then button. on your PC, you're gonna see um, iTunes pop up. So you can just um, close it and go back to Wondershare Doctor Phone and you can see this page pop up where it tells your device model and then we have the system that um, we need to restore. So we have 13.7. And if you want to fix the issues now, you can just download um, the IPSW inside this application, um, inside the software, or you can just download the IPSW outside. Now I'm going to download from outside. I'm going to go back to my browser here. And then I can go to IPSW.me, um, where I can just um, select my iPhone. And after that, I can select my iPhone SE. And then I can select the IPSW. You need to check the green one. You need to download the green one. And then you can just um, finally hit on download IPSW here. And then it should pop up like that. But for me, because I have already downloaded, so I don't need to download one more time. I just import it um, straight away. And one more thing that I want to mention for this software, it does support both Windows and Mac. So you can download either for Windows or Mac. Now I'm going to click on select IPSW and after that I'm going to find my IPSW right here. It is on my desktop and I can click on open. And after that we can finally click on fix now. And you can just wait for this process to finish. And one more thing, make sure your computer is connected to the internet as well. Otherwise it may fail to repair. Now the repair is completely done, so I can just um, set up and I can just unplug my phone and I'm going to set up and speed this video so you don't have to wait. Finally, the repair is complete and you can see I am currently on iOS 13.7. Now let me go to setting, then go to general 
and you can take a look on my about here so after the repair we have certain point seven which is um, the official version from Apple thanks for watching then I will see you guys in the next one